हेलो हेलो अस्सलाम वालेकुम इट्स गुड इवनिंग एंड गुड नाइट एवरीवन अक्रॉस द ग्लोब आई एम अनबर आई गॉट गयूर हबीब एंड शेख नजीर एंड वी आर गेस्ट कमांडर इमो इमरान विद अस कमिंग बैक टू द गेम एम्पेरोस पोस्ट वन द टॉस एंड देयर कैप्टन विदाउट एनी हेजिटेशन डिसाइडेड टू बैट फर्स्ट बट मे आई रिमाइंड यू लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन इट्स अंडर लाइट्स गेम इट्स अ डे नाइट एनकाउंटर ball can swing both ways and it's emperor's post taking on royal goodwill toss one by emperor's post well ishtiak rasul will be leading up front and this is a big game line it up tonight royal goodwill taking on emperor's post and we have with us former international cricketer and the coach of emperor's post mr surender khan na here well coming back to the business all set it's like that uh, it's it's looking that empty stadium but uh, to be precise it is an empty it's jam packed stadium and uh, once a cameraman will show you the visuals around the center all around the park you will see a great attendance a good size of viewers around the center to witness this all important match and it's royal goodwill taking on empire sports flood lights in full swing nice build up the two umpires for today's match haris raza asif raza the tv umpire mr majidura and we got our scorer and substitution mr jangi john and the commentary panel maisel manavar gayur habib and sheikh nazir man in hindi we have a guest commentator here well coming back to the game nazir winning the toss under lights decided to bat first we saw yesterday there was something going on ball was swinging both ways there was enough turn under lights winning the toss you again decided to a bat first you saw what happened with sultans yesterday oh let me take you through the playing 11 we start with emperor samaralam anchal singh ishbok she jatin saxena manish sharma rais ahmed sajjad ganai samiulla sumit mathur vikas nagar then wamek firdaus royal goodwill akib mir asif rasul ishtiaq rasul mujibul haq nasir bashir kumar nasir ganai ritik singh rohit bashir umal apti vision panchal why tele This is the playing 11. These are the two teams sheets, uh, sheets exchanged in the middle between two captains. Now it's time for the game here. It's Royal Goodwill taking on Emperor's Force. Royals in the middle. They are in a hurdle, a kind of a hurdle there on the other side. We're waiting for the toppers to make their way out to the center from Emperor's. And uh, look at the two umpires, Haris Raza and Asif Raza in the middle. And there is third umpire TV umpire also there Majid Hura. Well, Vijan Panchal is taking quick look up that surface there, but a great attendance again. A good crowd is in. This is Khabar Red Premier League season one match number seven, and it's another day night encounter underway. It's going to be a Royal Goodwill and Empire of Sports in action, and finally the two openers stroll out to centre. They're walking into the middle, and it's going to be. Why tell it to keep wickets for Royal Goodwill, and who are going to be the two openers? What kind of a pair they're going to use tonight? But may I remind you again, under lights, ball is going to swing both ways. Nazir, you will commence as the two openers are warming up a bit, reflexing arms. Mani Sharma is one. Well, the other one we shall come to know. Nazir, you will commence. Hardik Swagat, Sabi Shota Oka. मुकाबला रॉयल गुडविल क्रिकेट क्लब और एम्प्रोस्पोर्स का टॉस जीता एम्प्रोस्पोर्स ने और पहले बल्लेबाजी करने का निर्णय लिया है प्रारंभिक छोड़ अब मैदान की ओर अग्रसर और वहीं पे गुडविल की ओर से देखना होगा इस चाक रसूल गेंदबाजी प्रारंभ करेंगे और बड़ा दिलचस्प मौका होगा क्योंकि जिस प्रकार के हाव भाव है जिस प्रकार का यह मौकाबला है और इन परिस्थितियों में एक बेहतरीन और संघर्षपूर्ण मौकाबला अवश्य देखने को मिलेगा प्रारंभिक जोड़ी बीच मैदान में नजर आ रही है और एक छोर से मनीष शर्मा और दूसरे छोर से देखना होगा उनके साथ वाम को भेजा गया है तो ये जोड़ी है एम्प्रोस्पोर्स की और शुरुआत रॉयल गुडविल की ओर से विकेट की परवाह तेली बिल्कुल तैयार स्टम्प्स के पीछे 
और उनकी भूमिका रहेगी इस मुकाबले को लेकर के गुडविल हालांकि गुडविल ने अपने पिछले दो मुकाबले जीते हैं और ऐसे में अब वो तीसरे मुकाबले में विलंत कर रहे हैं और यहां आसिफ रसोल के हाथ में गेंद वो गेंदबाजी प्रारंभ करेंगे और पिछले मुकाबले में शानदार गेंदबाजी की थी आसिफ रसोल ने उन्हें आसिफ मशीर को चलता किया था सुल्तान के विरुद्ध वो मुकाबला हुआ था मनीष शर्मा स्ट्राइक लेने की तैयारी कर रहे हैं वहां में फिर दो उनके साथ प्रारंभिक जोड़ी के रूप में लेकिन अगर आसिफ रसूल की बात करें तो एक दिग्गज खिलाड़ी है एक महान खिलाड़ी है और उनके पास अनुभव की कमी नहीं है बहुत ज्यादा क्रिकेट वो खेल चुके हैं तो यहां उनका अनुभव निश्चित तौर पे टीम के काम आने वाला है बड़ा दिलचस्प और संघर्ष पूर्ण मौका प्रारंभ से होगा प्रारंभिक जोड़ी एक ठोस शुरुआत की आवश्यकता आपके विचार इंटरेस्टिंग Oh, oh, oh what happened it is run out here first ball huge drama utter drama and manish sharma is gone look at manish sharma he lost his cool he is walking up the field he is looking skybird he is looking disgusted he can't believe he is gone for not he's gone for gold and a lot of happening on the very first ball a mix up and it's manish sharma on his way take a look again look into this one money defends you short and look at that oh he sent him back he sold him down the river and it's one down emperor so one for none in over number one then none for one to be precise they one down oh bizarre kind of a way bizarre bizarre from warmick sold his partner down the river it was call of warmick defensive shot he was looking at the ball and the field approaching the ball but on the other side warmick was off way mark asked money to come in then sent him back and money says where i can go i am off way mark and now sir can i quickly on to the ball why till it has rest it's money sharma run out now sir can i and why till it wicket number 1 down nazir have a say देखिए दुर्भाग्य रहा यहाँ मनीष शर्मा का और वो आउट होकर मैदान से बाहर चले गए हैं पहले विकेट के रूप में जतिन सक्सेना उनके स्थान पर इस समय बीच मैदान में पहुंच चुके हैं और रॉयल गुडविल काफी उत्साहित पहली गेंद पर विकेट रन आउट के रूप में मनीष शर्मा का और मनीष शर्मा का जबकि फॉर्म में पिछले मुकाबले में आपने देखा बेहतरीन पारी उन्होंने खेली थी लेकिन आज उन्हें शुरुआत में ही वापस लौटना पड़ा तो बड़ा नुकसान उठाना पड़ा यहाँ बल्लेबाजी में एम्ब्रोस फोर्स की टीम को यहां से उसकी भरपाई के लिए एक चुनौती आपके सामने और एक साझेदारी निभाने होगी वेल नीड पार्टनरशिप अप फ्रंट एग्री विद द स्टेटमेंट वेल एब्सोल्युटली राइट दे वन डाउन इट्स नॉट फॉर वन इन ओवर नंबर 1 न्यू मैन इज जतिन सक्सेना मार्किंग द फ्रेश गॉड गेटिंग रेडी विद द सिलिपिन प्ले सो गुड डिलीवरी इट्स थ्रू प्लेइंग इनसाइड द लाइन ऑफ द बॉल एंड पास टेन एज देयर इनटू द सेफ हैंड्स ऑफ विकेट कीपर वेल partnership is what they require at the moment they need a good start they need a positive start up front yeah you won down a bizarre kind of a way lost to manish sharma experienced campaigner seasoned campaigner is back to pavilion but jethan is also looking in in spot above the there is unable to middle the ball is playing inside which is a very good thing but you need to take care of that outer splice of the blade you can't close the bat face and look at that one worked away nicely good looking shot this time and he's up for a quick single and look at the cheer look at the round of applause it's first run on the board well first runs on the board it's one for one after four balls in over number one royal goodwill taking on empire sports it's kyber red premier league season 1 match number 7 underway and it's a big match again yesterday we saw royal goodwill outclassed sultans tonight it's emperos can they resist are they going to put in a lot of fight tonight let's find it out let's run for one in over number one asir rasul not the wicket to his career but he is going to take it he's used to these things and usually and the team dugout is up and cheering that run it is just to release and relieve the nerves of amik purdos he will be under pressure of selling of selling his partner partner there it was mani sharma the man in
कौन साइड में खेला गैप पैदा खेला है गेंद को पीछे खिलाड़ी आ रहे हैं जब तक वी गेंद को फेल करते वहां रन पूरा कर लिया बल्ले पर सुने और अच्छी रणनीति दो रन और खाते में आठ एक विकेट के नुकसान पे एक दशमलव तीन ओवर की गेंदबाजी इस चक्र रसोल अपना पहला ओवर अभी तक उन्होंने चार रन खर्चे हैं तीन गेंदों से और आसिफ रसूल का पहला ओवर जिसमें चार रन आए बढ़िया ओवर रहा और ऐसे में देखना होगा यहां से किस प्रकार से बल्लेबाजी होगी बड़ा दिलचस्प देखने लायक मौका होगा दूधिया प्रकाश में नहाया हुआ स्टेडियम दहली पब्लिक स्कूल क्रिकेट ग्राउंड जहां से यह लाइव प्रसार आप तक पहुंच रहा है और ऐसे में इश्तिया रसूल गेंदबाजी कर रहे हैं इस बार बढ़िया स्टॉक इस बार खूबसूरत स्टॉक लेकिन सीधे वहां खिलाड़ी नासिर कुमार के पास उन्होंने गेंद को फेल कर लिया रन बनने की संभावना वहां पर थी नहीं और ऐसे में आठ एक विकेट के नुकसान पर ये कुल मिलाकर दूसरा ओवर वामिक और जतिन सक्सेना अरे ऐसे में देखना होगा यहां इश्तिया रसूल प्रारंभ में क्या विकेट दिला पाएंगे इस बार अच्छी गेंद थी खूबसूरत गेंद और खेला जरूर मिडल ऑफ द बैट से ठीक गेंद के पिच तक आए और अच्छी रणनीति है बल्लेबाज की आत्मविश्वास के साथ संयम के साथ प्रारंभ में बल्लेबाजी करनी है विकेट के मजाज को परखना है गेंदबाज को पढ़ना है फिर स्ट्रोक्स खेलने सिंगल डबल से स्ट्राइक को रोटेट करना रोटेशन काफी महत्वपूर्ण रहने वाला है इस मुकाबले में और जितना आप सिंगल डबल से स्ट्राइक को रोटेट करेंगे उतना दबाव से खिलाड़ी अपने आप को दूर रख सकते हैं और विपक्षी टीम पर एक एक रन से आप दबाव बना सकते हैं तो क्या उसमें सफलता मिलेगी अथवा नहीं ये देखना होगा आठ फेक और इस बार ऑन साइड में स्ट्रोक खेला खाली इलाका चुना गेंद सीमा से से बाहर निकल गई चार रनों के लिए अंधते सफलता मिली यहां बल्लेबाज वामिक को और चौका बटोरा अपने टीम एम्प्रोस फोर्स के लिए ना कि अंतिम गेंद पर ये चौका और इस बार लेग साइड में और क्या खूबसूरत ये प्लेसमेंट थी खाली क्षेत्र में गेंद सीमा रेखा से बाहर निकली चौका जरूर ओवर संभवतः यहां समाप्त हुआ दो पूरे और दो ओवर की समाप्ति के बाद बारह एक प्रकट के नुकसान पर इट्स ट्वेल्थ वन आफ्टर टू स्टॉक रसूल फर्स्ट ओवर गॉन फॉर एट नो विकेट्स एंड इट्स टाइम फॉर आसिफ रसूल टू कम एंड ऑपरेट फ्रॉम दर एंड फर्स्ट ओवर गॉन फॉर फोर and the wicket in the door in the form of run out it's 12 for one announced strike will be jatin saxena jatin saxena is batting on 4 for 5 vamik is on 8 from 6 ambrose 12 for one after two here goes asif pozwal lifted that one up clears the infield and finds the boundary for more runs runs started coming now and could see jatin saxena's that slog sweep comes into play whipped it away from the middle and leg and finds the boundary with these four more runs and score goes to look at his style crevis had batting and by his facial expression he's looking like that australian mid australian i may call him getting those mustaches out and he's on strike it's 16 for one <laughs> and over number 3 we are and projected score suddenly went up and it shows 148 now And Jatin Saxena, he's on eight from six. It's sixteen to one in over number three. Asif Rasool continues to bowl, and here he goes again, and again. What a shot of the pads! Finds the second place again. Finds the boundary one more time. Not while evening this, but it's Imperial's time now. Keep that wicket away. Beyond that, they're playing really well. Look at the shot selection. This is what was missing again at Sultans. maybe and you are absolutely right they uh, it's a perfect start and looking positive from very bad go yeah they lost to the bigger money sharma but now it's uh, jatin saxena oh look at that turn swept hard upish aerial runs four of them and a good delivery this time right on money quickly on to the ball and jatin can't find a run here find a man in place well you're absolutely right and uh, it isn't looking like uh, yesterday what we witnessed it what just happened at here yesterday night and it was a royals night and sultans couldn't fight but at the moment emperors a kind of a force which is putting on a show here they are 20 for 1 we are in over number 3 but it's going to be a stiff competition a seesaw battle let's find it out we are in over number 3 penultimate ball is coming up down the leg side again up the pads goes down to where the short find picked up a single one more run added to the tally and uh, jatin saxena is an indian first class cricketer i don't think this is the sam lad is it or oh, you may you may you may confirm and uh, 
collected the details. Okay, you may go carry on and uh, later on we, will, we may discuss about it. But you may keep that uh, in its abundance, the information regarding this lad. Leg by signal, it's 21 for 1. As we are in open number 3, last ball of over number 3. Oh, good delivery, awkward bounce. Short for stumping. And uh, Arsi Peraza simply sends it upstairs. This Calagampar. And let's find it out on your big screen. Coming up. It's decision pending. Short for stumping. Sent upstairs. Find it out here. On your big screen right now. Displaying what it is. Let's find it out. Here is our Cypress Soul. Is it foot rooted to the ground? Let's see. Decision pending. Decision pending. Oh, just somehow. He is back into the crease and uh, he's put his ground in. Look at the road from the crowd again. A round of applause because they're delighted. They know that this lad is putting on a show. He's tr trying to take game away from Royals. He is resisting the big signal. Oh, on, on your big screen, the signal is not out and he's safe. He's home. It's 21 for 1. But nowadays, we have third umpire. We have TV umpire. Mr. Majidura in this tournament, which is a great sign. Now something is happening in Valley too. Well, talking of cricket has evolved. We used to have just a single camera. But today we have plenty in place. We have all the angles available, mashallah. And in the coming time, we're going for the ball tracker and other things. Look at that one. Somehow gets away with that one. Wasn't a good short selection there. That, uh, that wasn't a good at all. Doesn't middle either. But he gets away with that one. And uh, unable to middle it. Of the inner splice, it's better to... Let the ball come in and then top of the shot and play close to the body or get to the pitch of the ball. And uh, Jatin all of a sudden, he's an Indian first class cricketer. He has also played IPL for Rajasthan Royals. And uh, there is the man at mid off who sent us in a return, hitting the timber there. But he's again home. He's safe again. Well, it isn't easy to play IPL. Represented uh, Rajasthan Royals who lifted the mayor first title, the inaugural edition of Indian Premier League. And uh, there was one of the legendary cricketers of all time, Sean Watson, the then player of the team. Now he's not uh, among us or with us, but uh, one of the legendary cricketers. He has more than 700 wickets under his belt. Well, it's uh, coming back to the game, 22 for 1. Nazir, 3.2 three done, done, it's 22 for 1. Somehow, these two batters are trying to resist the royal night and they're trying to make it for their side they want to break that winning streak of royals which is a great sign which is a positive sign and as as an athlete you need to produce something special because nowadays entire globe is watching you guys so what do you possess in abandoned just showcase that is it well here is ishtiak rasul again oh flicked away onto the inside good looking shot had still but there is production there is a malapti who does mop up one more run added to the tally. One, uh, uh, one more run added. 23 for 1. Nazir. Under lights. Ball is going to swing. But at the moment, we haven't seen that much tonight. But yesterday night, I think there was little moisture yesterday. Because of the cover was throughout the day on, th on that second pitch. Which was used for that night encounter. This one uh, hits him on the pad. Wanted a single. Lot of drama there again. Art of drama. But he gets away with it again. We're talking about there was a little moisture. And that allowed the ball... To make those, uh, uh, we saw a few of the, uh, okay, on few of the occasions, or we can say, we saw at a couple of occasions, the ball was swinging both ways, and it was changing its uh, uh, orientation or the direction. You know, one, one more thing I'm going to add here, that it was keeping low yesterday night, but today it's coming good onto the bat. Look at that one, hits him on the pad, but the angle drips it down the leg, so won't be given as LBW. But it's 24 for 1. Runs are important. Rotation of strike is another key aspect. What do you make of that? Look, this is no doubt. Because rotation is a very important thing. And in the last match, I will talk about it. And 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 I will talk about it. 
अच्छा खासा कार्य किया है यहां एम्प्रोस के बल्लेबाजों ने उस पड़ा है उस परिस्थिति को उन गेंदबाजों को और यहां उस प्रकार का बिल्कुल भी आतंक जोखिम उठाया नहीं है जतन सक्सेना और वहां पर फिरदोस ने भले ही मनीष शर्मा रनआउट के रूप में मैदान से बाहर चले गए लेकिन बड़ा बेहतर मुकाबला क्योंकि जिस प्रकार की शुरुआत चाहिए थी अभी तक चार ओवर में बेहतर शुरुआत मिली है चौबीस जरूर बने हैं विकेट एक खोया है लेकिन धीरे धीरे से ये साझेदारी पनपती हुई और इस साझेदारी को और बड़ा करना होगा जितना आप साझेदारी को बड़ा करेंगे उतना दबाव से अपने आप को दूर रख पाएंगे वो आत्मविश्वास खिलाड़ियों में बढ़ता चला जाएगा और एक बार आप आत्मविश्वास के साथ बल्लेबाजी करने लगे तो निश्चित तौर पर एक बेहतरीन पारी देखने को अवश्य मिल सकते हैं जतिन सक्सेना जो कि एक बेहतरीन क्रिकेटर है अच्छा खासा उनके पास अनुभव है और उस अनुभव का बेहतर तरीके से इस्तेमाल और पिछले ओवर में कुछ बेहतरीन शॉट उन्होंने खेले हैं और वहां से आपकी कला दर्शती है कि आप किस कैलिबर के खिलाड़ी हैं और वो पूरी तरह से यहां इस बारे में उनको दिखाना होगा आक्रमण करना होगा जो आपकी शैली है जो आपकी क्षमता है जो आपकी प्रतिभा है उस प्रतिभा का बेहतर तरीके से इस्तेमाल करना होगा इन परिस्थितियों में इस बड़े मुकाबले में फिलहाल आसिफ रसूल नया ओवर प्रारंभ करने जा रहे हैं इस बार बेहतर स्ट्रोक सीधे बल्ले से खूबसूरत वहां हालांकि पहले प्रयास में ओवर लेफ्ट से मिस फील्ड हुआ अब जाकर के जब दूसरे प्रयास में फील्ड करते थ्रो करते हैं तो निश्चित तौर पे यहां पे कुछ रन जरूर बटोरे बल्लेबाजों ने पांचवें ओवर के शुरुआत हो चली है आज से प्रसूल दो दशमलव एक ओवर चौदह रन छब्बीस पे एक चार दशमलव एक के बाद जातिन सोलह सोलह के दूसरे वापिक फिर दोस्त नो और इस साझेदारी की आवश्यकता है क्योंकि अंडरलाइट्स आसान परिस्थितियां रहती नहीं है और ऐसे में यहां बल्लेबाजी करना मैं समझता हूं इन परिस्थिति में एक कड़ी परीक्षा होगी बल्लेबाज की एक और अच्छी गेंद खूबसूरत गेंद ऑफ स्टंपर और गेंद सीधे विकेट कीपर की और आक्रमण सही दिशा में करना होगा आसिफ रसुल एक लीजेंडरी क्रिकेटर हैं उनके पास अनुभव की कमी नहीं है और यहां वो एक विकेट की तलाश में जरूर रहेंगे तीसरे ओवर में अब तक चौदह रन खर्चे हैं सफलता उन्हें मिली नहीं है और यहां बाहरी किनारा लेकिन सीधे वहां पर खिलाड़ी के पास मुजीबुल हक वहां पर तैनात है उन्होंने रूप शीर क्षमा कीजिएगा रूप शीर ने गेंद को फेल कर लिया अरे रन संख्या इस समय छब्बीस पे पांचवे ओवर में छह रन प्रतिवर्ग के हिसाब से रन बने एम्ब्रोस फोरस एक अच्छी शुरुआत और उसी मुद्रा में इसमें बल्लेबाजी हो रही है एक और यहां गेंद बिंदी गेंद और इन परिस्थितियों में देखना होगा यहां से किस प्रकार की बल्लेबाजी होगी छब्बीस पे एक चार दशमलव तीन के बाद इट्स ट्वेंटी सिक्स फोर वन इन फाइव and jitin needs to understand one thing he might have that experience of first class of ipl but he is again as the still lot of the valley it's asib rasul not an easy customer he needs to understand that thing and again outside edge straight to the fielder at cover no run it's over there taken a single they're good running between the wicket single and score goes to 27 good come back from asib rasul they just three runs from this over it's 27 for one in over number 5 Two balls to go, as Vamik back on strike. Nine to Vamik, seventeen to Jatin Saxena. Asi bowling the third over of his spell. Here he comes again, and again, booty, and decision sent up stairs off stumping Wahid Tilly behind the stumps. He was quick to op operate with his gloves. He whipped up the bales. Decision pending. Waiting for the third umpire signal. Was his foot in the air? Was it in the air? It could be close. It could be close. I think he has made it. It looks like very close. Was his foot grounded? Was his foot grounded? Was it foot ground? Yes, it is. He is inside. He is home, and he is safe. But Wahid Ali is very quick behind the stumps. Very, very quick. But he is safe. He is home. And Ramik Firdos has a lifeline, and only a Red Premier League could give you such glimpses, such scenes, and such scenarios. And credit goes to the management of Khyber Red Premier League for getting such type of a cricket in the Valley quality. And that out is the signal, and Ramik Firdos has a laugh there. He survives. Rasib Rasool bowling the third over of spell. But one thing you got to admit. The wicket was not that much bad. The way Sultans made it look like. Well, uh, Gayura, uh, I was talking about uh, wrong shot selection. Have you gone through my words yesterday? I mentioned that it was a wrong shot selection. Ball was keeping little bit now, Nazir, but it was wrong shot selection. They were not using the skills. They were not using the skill set. They were not using the foot moment. 
Head wasn't still there and uh, look at that one. Andre Van. Man at me down. Can't cut it off. That's for Andre Van. Straight down the ground. What a shot there from Jitin Saxena. He brings in that huge experience. And he's a uh, first class cricketer. And has also played IPL. And look at that shot. He's a top notch lad. And that four is also top notch. Straight down the ground, on driven handsome. And it was Ishtar Krasul, 31 for one. Now decided to go at it. Oh, want it out. This could be tight. Oh, look at that. He lost the ball. Not a clean stop. He was almost a gone there. But Gayur once again. Needless from Jatin Saxena. A man like Jatin who's middling the ball, who's padding run a ball at the moment. 21 of 21. Needless. He wanted to skip down the track. And he was in all sorts of trouble there. Look at that one. But Tanag tried his level best. Oh, he lost to the ball. Not a clean stop. Would have been in all sorts there. Man was Jatin Saxena in question. But he survives. Nog is unhappy. Disgusted. An opportunity. Gone begging. But look at Akimi, the skipper of side. He's packing his lad. You need captain up to the mark. You need captain as agile as cat on the field. Adon. The next one. Oh, good looking shot. Punched in the gap again. That's for biceps cover and extra cover. Glorious. Spanked. Punched and crunched. Through extra cover for four. Another boundary here. Take a look again. Oh, with an offer. Asking to be hit. Call it a shot there. Jatin Saxena. What a shot there. Beauty. And it's now on the receiving end today. Three balls, eight of the other. Oh, look at that one. Little Apish in the gap again. But oh, Miss Phil fumbled there. And now he's unhappy. Not can't believe. Hand on his forehead. That's for four, number three of an over. Flicked up nicely. Another four here, Nazir. Quality shot from Jatin Saxena. Yeah. कमाल के वो बल्लेबाज हैं और क्या खूबसूरत स्ट्रोक लाए उनके दम पर और सीधे बल्ले से दर्शनीय स्ट्रोक उन्होंने खेले आज और दर्शा दिया वो किस शैली के बल्लेबाज हैं यहाँ उनकी कलास दर्शती हुई यहाँ उनकी कला दर्शती हुई और इस बार बेहतर तरीके से स्ट्रोक खेलने का प्रयास जरूर किया था लेकिन अभी भी एक गेंद का समाप्ति आना बाकी है ये छठा ओवर लेकिन जिस प्रकार से मनीष शर्मा का विकेट मिला और उसके बाद जतिन सक्सेना जिस प्रकार के पारे खेली है एकदम बहुत ही बढ़िया और अब तो दबार कब तक उन्होंने बल्लेबाजी किया लाजवाब बेहतरीन प्रदर्शन अब तक उन्होंने किया है और इस बार पटकने का प्रयास हालांकि ठीक तरीके से बल्ले पे आई नहीं ऑन साइड पे एक रन दौड़ करके पूरा कर लिया वहां पटकने का प्रयास तो किया जरूर था एक रन तो मिला जरूर अंतिम गेंद पर ओवर समाप्त हुआ चालीस पे एक it's 40 for one, and remember Jitin Saxena, he's a 42-year-old lad. Emperor's Force, Captain Umar Alam, he got Anchal Singh there. There is Ishfaq Shah, Jitin Saxena, Mani Sharma, Rais Ahmed, Sajad Ganai, Samiullah, Samit Mathur, Vikas Nagar, and Mamik Fudus on the other side. We got Royal Goodwill, Captain Akimir, there is Asib Rasul, Ishtiak Rasul, Mujib Al-Haq, Nasir Bashir Kumar, Nasir Ganai, Ritik Singh, Roo Bashir, Umar Lefty, Vijan Panchal, and Wahid Tiri. Packed side, 10, 9. Nine quality battles in the side as far as Royal Goodwill is concerned. Nine. And they got plenty of batting options tonight. And Emperor's Force on their side. Look, they have not enough runs on the board. It's just 40 of six. But what man thing is they have nine wickets in hand. And they can shift gears anywhere from here. So that's the beauty. The way they batted, that's the experience. And that is what the quality cricket means. As far as Jatin Saxena is concerned, he's a 42-year-old man. 42 here. He got plenty of experience. And look at the points table. Royal Goodwill at the top. And number two. Then number three and followed by other teams. It's 40 for one after six power play ends. Balanced power play, I may say. Royal Goodwill, they did not leak to NF runs. Just 40 on the board and on the other side. Emperor's Force. They got their foot stationer there. They are 40 and just one wicket down. They have nine wickets in hand. Jatin Saxena. He's batting really well. It's time for Asip Rasul to come for the last time in his spell. He's going to continue. It's 40 for 1. Over number 7 about to start. Jatin on strike. He's on 30 from 26. Split screen used. New things introduced. And we might get more and more. And again. And there is Skipper. 
and you can't take chance against Takemir, not at all, not the man you want to take. Definitely, he is a big man. He's an experienced lad. He's a quality player. And again, now quality. And again, and Wamik Firdos always on the receiving end, and he has sold his one partner. It's time for second. Jatin Saxena. This is the second time he survives. One, it was gone. Harish Tagrasul picked up that ball cleanly. And here goes Asip Rasul one more time. Jatin on strike. Shorter length goes on the back foot. Rolled him to the back and fix up the gap. And what a feel. It's Mujib al Haqdir. Is it a clean stop? We will have a look. But I think he has stopped and saved some runs for his team. We'll pick up a single there. It's 41 to 1 in of number 7. सातवें ओवर में हालांकि स्ट्रोक बढ़िया था लेकिन उससे भी शानदार क्षेत्र रक्षण वहां मुजीबुल हक ने अरे निश्चित तौर पर यह चौका बचाया और इसी बीच सफलता वामित फिरदौस को चलता किया आसिफ रसूल ने और एक्सपीरियंस की बात हो रही थी अनुभव की बात हो रही थी वो अनुभव यहां आसिफ रसूल का काम आया टीम के और विकेट दिलाया पहला विकेट आसिफ रसूल के खाते में और दूसरा विकेट रॉयल गुडविल को मिलता हुआ और आप देख सकते हैं गेंदबाजी अनुभव ये गेंद और क्या खूबसूरत गेंद क्या बेहतर गेंद टिप्पा खाने के बाद अंदर की तरफ और सीधे स्टंप्स पे वहां काम का और वो जो बेहतर अनुभव है उसका बेहतर तरीके से इस्तेमाल और वो जो कटर्स का इस्तेमाल करते हैं वो बेहतर करते हैं और उसी के चलते यहां विकेट मिला एक और इकतालीस पे दूसरा छह दशमलव चार के बाद one more bites the dust and in a hurdle now some respite again breaking the stand and also pursue the crisis man is rolling fingers over the ball he's using that middle middle finger which is making it happen making the ball to twist and look at that again look at that this the palm is right behind the ball is putting a lot of force giving the force to the ball and is giving it a go like this and then this middle finger is right on top of the ball and making it curl a bit coming into the right hand he has no idea he closes the bat face early it's 41 for two we are in over number seven look at the split screen again it's Sumit Mathur in at number four but uh, Guyur was talking about uh, in balance power play 40 on the board they were one down now they are 41 for two it's in balance but this lad hanging in balance talking of game but this lad he's got a huge talent and experience what a lad he is an Asip Rasul in his fourth over he's gone for 16 and picked up a wicket now he's among the wickets you were talking about that run out won't be included now this one we surely go into the kitty and it's Sumit Mathurin he joined Jatin Saxena in the middle someone need to bat on the other side to sport Jatin and he wanted a single straight away. Is he going to get that? I think he scampered through. He's, oh, he's, yes, he's up the mark straight away. One more run at it. But at the moment, uh, Royal Goodwill is happy to concede singles. We saw only that ever where three, four boundaries came. It was knock bowling against the likes of Jatin. Saxena and Saxena took him on. And uh, he decided to go against uh, now again, this one little uppish, but he gets away with it. Falling well, short of man, they're on the bounce to field. Done with seven, successful over comes to an end. It's 42 for two. This is Khabarad Premier League, season one, match number seven underway. Now the conversation is going on. Ritik Singh is warming up, I think. Ritik is another top lad. He's a wonderful customer with the ball. And Asip Rasul is having a word with uh, Ritik there. If Ritik comes in, here in this over number eight under lights let's see how he's gonna turn the ball we haven't seen that much turn tonight we haven't seen that much swing but talking of Asif Rasul he is like that to call it in Hindi Harpan Maula Khiladi he's an all-rounder and he's a, someone who's outside syllabus for you guys you need to read him properly then to offer the shot uh, the way he has played the domestic cricket I heard from uh, plenty of guys that Asif was totally something outside syllabus you need to, if you want to discuss about Asip Rasul, you need to read him properly first. Then to, uh, you need to apply yourself. Then top of the shot again as to this lad. It's 42 for 2. 
after seven hours. Over number eight is about to start. This is Cabaret Premier League season one, match seven. Okay, Buran, go ahead. Coming back to the game, it's 42 for two. Fresh off first ball. Plays it back along the track. Baller does mop up. But Gayur, these, uh, these lads need to keep it tight. Make the batters toil out for everything. On the other side, they need to break free. At least rotate. Look at that one again coming into the batter. Eyeing a big shot here. I don't think this is a, that kind of a wicket where you can uh, go after the bowler each and every time. You need to adjust first. Then top of the shot. And under lights won't be easy. That's another thing you need to keep in mind. And then to offer the shot or then to go after. But you need to up the tempo too. You are in over number 8. You are just 43. Rightly mentioned, but they got two best batters. It's Jatin Saxena and Sumit Mathur out in the middle. This time tries to sweep it. But somehow managed to get an escape there. Straight to the keeper. But one thing is that Jatin and Sumit, both are the first class cricketers. And they have plenty of experience. They need to use that. And it will show us how the cricket is being played. Like the wickets. And now he goes again. Oh, somehow managed. Somehow. Ritik Singh almost. Ritik Singh, he is a first class cricketer. And somehow managed to stop the batter. There. It's Jatin Saxena. One more time on strike. He is on 31 from 32. And again this time with that angle. Blade tries to play it. But finds the failure. It's Akimir interested there. And no run, I think. It's a dot ball. And look at Jatin Saxena's strike rate. He's batting on 31 from 33 balls. He needs to shift the gears now. The guy has almost played six overs. And again on the back foot. Plays it. And plays it straight to the fielder at extra cover. There is Mujibul Haq. Will get a single and the single will bring Sumit Mathur back on strike. It's 44 for two after eight. It's below six at the moment. One turn is the current run rate. But 12 overs left. And they need to shift the gears now. They have eight wickets in hand. It's time to shift the gear. They have got race back waiting padded up. The guy who wrecked havoc in yesterday's game. We know that. What he can do. What kind of a player he is. And they have a quality shift. Natuj Anshil Singh is there. Umar Alam can bowl. And this guy Sumit Mathur has bowled really well. So 150 will make it a good contest.
Oh, that's a good shot from Zaya Jatin Saxen. Oh, he's caught it long on. I thought it, it will go all the way. But he finds this man in place. Caught it long on. And the man at long on boundary takes easy one of the bowling of Ritik. I thought he middled. He middled, I think, but unable to find the elevation and the distance. It's within the boundary line there. Look at that. Oh, it's well inside, almost one yard inside the boundary line. Nasir Ganai, the man, takes a catch and one more bites the dust. Set battery is gone. Ritik Singh for Ritik Singh among the wickets. He breaks the stand and it's none other than Jatin Saxen on his way. And Asif Rasul is coming off the field in a hurdle team. Royal Goodwill and we have Asif Rasul here. He bowled tight spell of four overs. And look at Vijan and other lads. Ritik is delighted. So the other team members. They have their third 53 for three. After 9.4, we are in over number 10, Nazir. They are three down. Need a में लक्ष्य में इतना होगा आसान परिस्थितियां हैं नहीं लेकिन क्या लक्ष्य रहेगा क्योंकि बल्लेबाजी में आपके पास विकल्प है बल्लेबाजी में आपके पास दमखम है तो वो काफी महत्वपूर्ण स्थिति रहने वाली है फिलहाल रईस अहमद नए बल्लेबाज ऋतिक सिंह इस ओवर पर दो खेत अभी भी उनके ओवर की शेष है वो इस ओवर को पूरा करना चाह रहे हैं त्रेपन तीन विकेट के नुकसान पर दसवा ओवर अब धीरे धीरे से समाप्त होने जा रहा है धोखे धोखा ना बाकी ऋतिक सिंह एक विकेट की खुराक लेने के बाद काफी उत्साहित होंगे आत्मविश्वास लौटा होगा अरे वे अब गेंदबाजी करेंगे क्योंकि इन परिस्थितियों में त्रेपन तीन विकेट के नुकसान पे धोखी धुकाना बाकी है इस ओवर में दसवें ओवर में गेंदबाजी और कड़ा संघर्ष हर अच्छी खासी मात्रा में दर्शक यहां उपलब्ध ऋतिक बाय हाथ की गेंदबाज एक बार फिर अच्छी गेंद थी खूबसूरत गेंद थी ऐसे में दौड़ करके रन तो पूरा कर लिया दोनों बल्लेबाजों ने नाग के पास गेंद गई उन्होंने फील्ड तो कर लिया एक रन लेने से नहीं रोक पाए एक रन और खाते में और एक रन के साथ रन संख्या पहुंची चौवन तीन विकेट के नुकसान पर एक गेंद का आना बाकी यहाँ रन गति की अगर हम बात करें बड़ा बेहतर तरीके से अब तक इस मुकाबले में गेंदबाजी के विकल्प को इस्तेमाल किया है रॉयल कुरवेल ने और एम्प्रोस फोर्स को चौवन तक सीमित रखा यहाँ पर पैड पे टकराई जरूर हल्की सी अपील और ऐसे में कोई प्रभाव नहीं स्वीकार नहीं क्या रन गति में कोई वृद्धि नहीं कोई क्षति नहीं ओवर समाप्त दस के बाद चौवन तीन विकेट के नुकसान पे हाफ ए मार्क हाफ ए स्टेज इट्स फिफ्टी फोर फोर थ्री इट्स सीजन वन मैच नंबर सेवन अंडर वे वी गट रॉयल गुड विल टेकिंग ऑन एम्पेर फोर्स एंड एम्पेर अगेन इन स्पॉट ऑफ बर्दर इन ट्रबल हियर इन डीप डीप ट्रबल वी गट अ गुड अटेंडेंस टू विटनेस This game, which is underway, being played between Royal Goodwill and Emperors, huge crowd is in. We got a good attendance to witness a big game. Another big game underway, match number seven. We are Royals of Ali here, and we are Emperors Post. Rais Kohli batted brilliantly yesterday, half centurion. Today it's a different day. He's got slip in place. There is remarkable cricketer at first slip. Take a look again. Who's in slip cordon? It's none other than Asif Rasul there. Here is Vijan. Punch out to ball. And dabs it back to the ball. No possibility of a run. A kind of a push. 
not for runs. Over number 11. Vijan in his second over. Economic. Miser with the ball. Look at his economy. Drives this one. Straight down the ground. Good drive. Good shot there. And every shot is being praised and applauded. It reminds me of English crowd in Edgebeston in, in the Mecca of cricket. Lotus. That's the disciplined crowd and they praise everything. That's why I call that praise is gallant for the crowd. Back in, uh, back in England, the English crowd is disciplined. And they back every side. And it's 55 for 3. This is a, re a Keber Red Premier League Season 1. Match number 7 underway. It's a night encounter being played under lights here. Here at DPS. This one goes big. But there is a man. Oh, look at that one. It bounced. Certain bounce. Abrupt bounce. He couldn't react and respond. It flies over his head. Off the bounce. And into the fence before. Take a look again. Awkward bounce of the outfield. Goes with the shirt tight. Slogs it away. Kneels down on one knee. And crowd looking for cover there. But Tamar left is again. Man, man in question there. <laughs> it is second occasion, but the first one that was put down. But this one, you can't blame him. Again, shuffle across, one-handed. Has that done the distance? Yes, it does. It's on to the rooftop. Take that, what a blow. Shuffle across. Oh, look into it again. Look at the flight. Oh, gone all the way, one-handed. It reminds me of Rishabh Panth. One-handed blow. On to the rooftop. And Vijan can't do very much with this one. And umpire is taking a quick look of the ball there. Harris Raza. Looking into the ball. It looks fine. And gives it back to the bowler. It's 65 for 3. And uh, attack is the best form of defense. You need to express yourself. The next one. Uh, good looking delivery. Again shuffle across. Plays it to mid on. Scamper through. The man from long on can come in. The man from mid wicket comes in to stop the ball. Just a single hit, 66 for 3. We are in over number 11. This over, dot single, 4, 6 single. That means 12 or 5 balls. This over, first away gone for 6. This over gone for 12. Here is Vijan, one last time to race Emma. Who's on to three, uh, 2 of 3 balls. Goes deep in crease. Plays it back along over done. We're done with over number 11. 11 gone, 66 for 3. Need a partnership and need some big overs here. Nazir, they need to fire at this very crucial juncture. Gahir, what do you make of it? Having seven of the batters in Kiri, I think one need to step up. At least one lad. Just try and give it something. Bat out your skins and put on a show. Because you are being, uh, you are being monitored across the globe nowadays. There is a huge fan base of JK Sports Time. And talking of Red FM JK on YouTube. So people across the globe and Kashmiris in different parts of the globe are watching you nowadays and capturing your moments, how you are applying yourselves, look at yourself and uh, display that character. And here is an opportunity for you guys, display that. Let us see how they're going to apply against Srithik Singh. There is still plenty left to do. Project stored still 120. They need plenty of runs here. So with Mathur came across, whipped away. And finds the fielder at long on. Ishya Krusul is there. will pick up a single. And the single will bring Ray Samad back on strike. Ray Samad, he hit his half century in the previous match. And he needs to capitalize now on this one. 67 for 3 in over number 12 we are. Still not in front on the board. I believe that. They at least need 150. 150 is a good total. For your bowlers, for the fielders, for everyone there. And that's the different kind of a thing. Then even 300 is not enough. If it's not now, Ishtar Rasul and Nasir Kumar today. And they have got one more talented lad. The wall, Mr. Consistent. We got Akib Mir there. And what a find he has been. He definitely against elegant strikers. What a knock he has played in that match. And all quality shots. It was not blind hitting. It was all quality shots. The proper cricketing scores. And they got Nasir Ganai, Mr. Finisher. Used to finish the things. Asib Rasul is there. Plenty of batting options. There is Mujibul Haq. There is Wahid Teli, a technically sound batter from South Kashmir, come across. And again, whipped away. Dealing in singles, not showing an intent here. It's definitely going to hurt Impros. They might be enjoying the partnership at the moment, but now they need runs. Just eight overs left after this one. They can't have 120 on the board with seven wickets left. At least if they are nine down and 150 is on the board, that's a good, a good total. I may say that.
देखिए मैं आपसे सहमत हूं क्योंकि जिस प्रकार के आवश्यकता थी उड़ाया यहां गेंद को और गेंद मैदान से बाहर ये छह मिलेंगे यहां पर बल्लेबाज को और बात हो रही थी या बड़े स्ट्रोक की आवश्यकता और ऐसे में एक बड़ा स्ट्रोक जरूर निकला वहां बल्ले से रईस के कदमों का इस्तेमाल किया मेडल ऑफ द बेस्ट से उठा करके खेला और ये छह रन यहां अर्जित किया अपने लिए और अपनी टीम के लिए और इस छक्का का साथ था बरन सा भाई इजाफा होता है बढ़ोतरी होते हुए रितिक के प्रति ये स्ट्रोक आसान नहीं लेकिन क्या शानदार आत्मविश्वास के साथ ये स्ट्रोक खेला रईस ने और उस प्रकार के बल्लेबाज की आवश्यकता भी थी छह रन और खाते में और छह रनों के साथ रन संख्या की बात करें पिछहत्तर पे तीन ग्यारह दशमलव चार अब जाकर के गियर्स बदलने हो गए इस बार गेंद के पिछ तक पहुंचे ऑन साइड में उसको प्लेस किया यार ये रन तो जरूर मिलेगा और एक रन और खाते में और एक रन के साथ छिहत्तर पे तीन एक एक रन से पारी को आगे बढ़ाने का प्रयास लेकिन अब जाकर के यहां से आठ ओवर बचेंगे ऋतिक दो दशमलव पांच चौदह एक विकेट उनके नाम और अंतिम गेंद देकर के तैयार एम्प्रोस फोरस पहले बल्लेबाजी कर रहा है ये दूसरा मौका अपना मैच नंबर सात खाईपर रेड प्रेमर लीग के अंतर्गत रितिक की ये गेंद और इस बार बाएं हाथ के सुमित माथुर ने ऑन साइड में उसको खेला वहां दूसरे प्रयास में गेंद को फील्ड तो कर लिया गया लेकिन रन लेने से नहीं रोक पाए यहां खिलाड़ी को और ऐसे में सतहत्तर पे तीन बारह पूरे दस रईस सात गेंदों से और सुमित माथुर ने अठारह बनाए चौदह गेंदों से और यहां से निश्चित तौर पर एक सौ बीस एक सौ तीस तक पहुंचना होगा क्योंकि जितना आप एक सौ तीस एक सौ चालीस लक्ष्य देंगे हालांकि डेढ़ सौ के आसपास तब जाकर के आपके गेंदबाज दूसरी पारी में कुछ बेहतर कर सकते हैं और जिस प्रकार की गेंदबाजी हुई है और मैं समझता हूं यहां से दबाव बनाने के लिए आपको कम से कम एक दो विकेट जल्द से जल्द झटकने होंगे एक दबाव बनेगा एम्प्रोस पॉस की टीम पर और वहां से फिर आप एक न्यूनतम लक्ष्य तक रोक सकते हैं बारह के बैच सतहत्तर पे तीन Look at the camera work. We got uh, technically sound team alongside us. It's their beauty. It's their camera work, which makes it amazing and wonderful, heart soothing and eye catching. Well, a short pause in the game. Emperos got race in the middle and Subit Mathur on to it in a 14 balls. Rupeshir is going to bowl. Rope into the attack here. He's measuring his run up there, and uh, Rice has brought on helmet, which is a great sign against spacer. You need this thing in place. You need all the safety measures. He has done well putting on helmet, which is a great sign. Well, uh, Rope shoots the ball for the first time. Well, I don't think uh, there is too much due tonight. I don't think. Well, uh, later on we will check and we will get there to find out how much dew is there because I haven't seen ballers using that towel to dry the surface of the ball as of now. And he's talking of those uh, those areas where it can uh, really reflect the light. Is it like that? Uh, it may show us a kind of a suspended particle there, but at the moment there is nothing like that. There is nothing, no reflection of the outfield. Here is uh, the fresh air. And he works it away. Little shuffle inside the line of ball. Works it away. A single is all. But everything is being praised. And they need that, this kind of goodwill gesture. And they need this kind of energy to back the boys. Well, uh, playing against Royals. Who have four points on the point table. Talking of their net run rate. It's balle balle. It's high flying. So it's a confident side. Having... Uh, Uh, all the departments up to the mark and it's looking confident side of the tournament so far we have seen this side is really on top on cloud nine uh, coming on their performances we have seen in the first game going down and uh, they were six down but we saw the comeback from skipper who scored unbeaten 71 and there is someone there always to back their lads to back the team and one lad is taking team out of trouble one lad is always there to bail them out so they got enough forces they got enough power in the kitty they got uh, all rounders in the lineup they got pacers they got spinners and they got middle order a formidable middle order and look at that one stammers rattled coming into the batter he wanted to thwack it straight down the ground wanted to go with the tide is clean it up and take a look again how he was clean it up and it's so bashir straight away he's among the wickets 
Oh, it came in. It came into the bat and it stays a bit low too. Under the bat, onto the stumps. So it's wicket. One more wicket down here in form of Ray Scully who looked in good touch today. But he's gone this time. Oh, couldn't middle this one. And a ball with a twobble. And he's talking of uh, that obstacle ball which gone for a walk there. But talking of the ball, it, it did reverse a bit after pitching with a twobble approaching the batter. Going on to hit. And Nazir, do you remember that ball which swung in meters against Umesetu? Rupa Shir bowled that ball last season. Not only in inches, it was in meters. And he, even a mess, he waited for the ball to come in. Then it came sharply back in. And he was cleaned it up through the gate, yeah. Well, it's 78 for four. It's over number 13, we are in. Aro Bashir among the wickets. Look at his figures. Three balls, one for one. And musical night. He's on it. Music on the other side. Well, this is Cabaret Premier League, season one, match number seven tonight on the way. Crowd is enjoying. Sajad Sultan walks in. Sajad Sultan of the Sajad Ganai, the Sultan of stays in. But uh, he failed to perform over the past couple of games. He's not that Sajad. He's known for big knocks, big innings. Is one such loading tonight? Hey, let's join. Split frame. We have split screen. Oh, good looking delivery. What a way to welcome newcomer. And it was cranking up. But he dropped his wrist in time and keeps it away on offside. A dot ball to welcome newcomer. Sajad and Sumit need to do their home homework properly now. Again, need to resurrect. One is to keep wickets intact, Gayur. Other thing is there is huge amount of pressure on us. One is to up the tempo. One is to keep wickets intact. What to do under certain circumstances? Well, a good-looking ball again. Clipped away, wanted a single. Won't get that again. Sumit Mathur, eh, Sumit Mathur is not going to risk his wicket here. He's not going to put himself at risk. He's going to bat according to the situation over here. He's going to take it deep. He wants to carry his bat till the very last end. Because they know that Nog and company have enough force. And they have enough resources in the batting. There is uh, Mujibullah in the middle order. There is Akib Mir in the middle order. And there is the great finisher, Umar Laptis. And uh, they've they got the white tail up the order. Nasir Kumar is there. Nasir Gana is there. They've got enough uh, batting in the line. They've got the great depth in the batting. And it's 79 for 4. 79 for 4 after 13 over number 14. About to start. Rubashir, his first over has gone for 2 and a wicket. Sumit Mathur. He's batting on 19 for 15, but they need to shift gears now. They need to show some intention. They can't bat with the same pace. They can't bat with the same strike rate. They need to go after the bowlers. They need to get runs. They need to get... And they have six wickets in hand. And the little cameos will help Emperor here to build and to set up a good total. Akimir into the attack. Now the skipper himself. It's coming to ball for the first time in three matches. It will be interesting to see how he goes with the ball in hand. But they have six wickets in hand and they have seven overs left. I think they should go for those little cameos. And here goes Akimir. First ball, plays it back to the ball. This is not the time for defensive shots. This is not the time for the defensive approach. And this is not the time for the defensive partnership. You need runs from both the ends now. They've got 41 balls left. They're just 79 on the ball. Look at the current run rate. It's 6.00. They're playing with a 6 run. And next ball down the leg. Wahe Tilly behind the stops made a mess of it. And fine, this is the boundary. Unconventional. But employers are going to take this one. Four leg buys. And Wahe Tilly behind the stumps made a mess of it. It went up the pads. And Wahe Tilly was not ready. And four more runs, but they need plenty of these. They need plenty. And I think one Sajad or Sumit, they should go show the shots now. यहाँ पे अब रनों की आवश्यकता भी है जैसा कि आपने जिक्र किया कुछ बड़े स्ट्रोक खेले होंगे ये गेंद ऑफ स्टेप पर और इस बार खूबसूरत स्ट्रोक लेकिन पीछे खिलाड़ी ना आ गए उन्होंने गेंद को फील्ड तो कर लिया और एक एक रन से कोई फर्क पड़ने वाला नहीं क्योंकि आवश्यकता है रन गति को तेज करने की चौरासी पे चार 
चौथवा ओवर पारे का वर्तमान स्थिति में चल रहा है आकिब मीर परिवर्तन के तौर पर पहला ओवर फेंक रहे हैं समित माथुर उन्नीस पंद्रह गेंद से सजात खान आई दो छह गेंद से और ऐसे में यहां से अब गियर बदलने हो गए एम्प्रोस फोर्स के बल्लेबाजों को क्योंकि अब रनों की आवश्यकता है छह दशमलव दो दो प्रतिवर के हिसाब से चौरासी बना लिए हैं चार विकेट खोए हैं अंतिम विकेट फरूख बशीर को मिला था और रईस को एक खूबसूरत गेंद पर अंदर आते गेंद को वहां चलता किया था और उसके बाद सजाद गनाई जिन्होंने छह गेंदों का सामना किया मात्र दो रन बनाए हैं सुमित माथुर उन्नीस फेटा बात है आखिर मेरी गेंदबाजी कर रहे हैं इस बार अच्छी गेंद थी और विकेट विकेट गेंदबाजी ऑन साइड में उसको खेला जरूर एक रन तो जरूर मिलेगा वहां और एक बार फिर एक रन से ही संतुष्ट रहेंगे एक रन के साथ रन संख्या पिछासी चार विकेट के रॉक्सम पे दो गेंदे शेष बची हैं और यहां से जितना आप आक्रमण करेंगे उतना बेहतर कहा जा सकता है क्योंकि यहां से अब रन गति को बढ़ाना है छह विकेट आपके पास सुरक्षित हैं तो ऐसे में कहीं ना कहीं अगर यहां से आठ नौ रन प्रतिवर के हिसाब से रन बनते हैं तो कुल मिलाकर आप एक सौ तक पहुंच सकते हैं लेकिन क्या वो रन गति तक पहुंच पाएंगे इस बार तिरछे बल्ले के साथ उसको गाइड जरूर किया था अरे ऐसे में रन तो जरूर मिला छियासी चार विकेट के नुकसान पर अंतिम गेंद इस ओवर के बचे हैं और वो लेकर का तैयार आकिब मीर सुमित माथुर बीस सोलह गेंद से आकिब मीर ने बढ़िया ओवर हालांकि इसमें एक चौका जरूर लेग बाई के रूप में आया और उसके अलावा तीन सिंगल और पहले ओवर में अच्छी गेंदबाजी ज्यादा अवसर दिए नहीं है बल्लेबाजों को सुमित माथुर जो कह रहे हाथ के बल्लेबाज पे और अंतिम गेंद पर कुछ बड़ा स्ट्रोक जी नहीं यहाँ ऑफ साइड में एक रन जरूर मिलेगा और जब तक खिलाड़ी आकर के उसको फील्ड करते फंबल हुआ पलट कर दूसरे रन के लिए जा रहे हैं और दो रन पूरे कर लिए यहाँ प्रशंसा करनी होगी तेज दौड़ बेहतरीन तालमेल का परिचय दिया दो रन और ओवर समाप्त चौदह के बाद अट्ठासी पे चार This over had gone for five. There was not an intention, a yot of intention to deposit the ball. Eighty-eight four wickets down after fourteen over number fifteen about start. Sumit Mathur batting on twenty-two from seventeen. Projected score it's one twenty-six still. As far as the bowling is concerned of Emperors, they have got a good bowling lineup, but they still need runs. Remember, you have got nine quality players on the opponent side, quality batters. So you need to keep that in mind. You need runs on the boat. It's Rohit Bashir who will continue. His first over has gone for two, and he has picked up a wicket in that over. Here he goes. On strike will be Sajad Ganai. First ball, play and a miss. Nothing on the bat, and it's a dot ball. In over number fifteen, it's eighty-eight for four, and I think their openers and their top order they fail. They could not lay that foundation. Even Jatin Sixena, he played almost six to seven overs. But could not get it even close to the runner ball. He played it below hundred strike rate, and again, getting it back in in deck from Rubashidia, and no chance to Sajad Ganai, where he is going to play. It's a dot ball, second in a row. Score is still at eighty eight, four wickets down, and the projected score it's coming down to one twenty three now. And Rubashid is bowling brilliantly, brilliantly. Sajad Ghanai on strike, <coughs> and Imperial Force they're eighty-eight for four. But one thing is there: after watching these stalwarts of the first class IPL and other playing, I think we still have better talent in Valley. The way they play, the way they are pulling the things back, the way they are batting, I may say. And next one lifted that one up inside out, one bounce into the boundary, four more runs, and crowd on their feet. Celebrating, praising, cheering, everything going around the corner at the moment. Four more. A look at the shot. He pitched that one up. Sajjad Sultan, classic shot. Yes, definitely talented lad. Plays that one up and one bounce into the boundary. But I will say, we were talking about the talent. We are not lacking behind. Believe me, this is a new experience for the lads. For the first time, I think they are playing the night match here on a valley. But still, the way they play, and again, chance has been run out. Akimi directed would have been interested. But one thing is there: we have seen seven matches and we have seen players across the India, but there there is no man like Akimi. Okay, you you may carry on, but crowd is really behind, right behind these lads. We saw the shot from Sajad Ganai being praised, and now a fumble on the field, and uh, you can hear that, you can listen into that hue and cry. It was uh, just like that ooze and ahs going on. But crowd is right behind these lads because 
they belong to the city. But talking of royals, they have players from different parts of the valley. All right, it's 93 on the board now. Four wickets down in over number 15. Still two balls to go. But look at Rubushir's figures. His second over, seven runs and a wicket. Sumit Mathur on strike. And Sumit needs to shift gears now. He's batting on 22 from 17. He has almost faced three overs. And he needs to change gears. He needs to get some runs for his team. And here goes Rubashir. And look at Sumit. No intention at all. He's just playing it, kept getting it down along the turf and getting singles, getting singles. We have seen him doing this. But he needs, he needs to change his gears now. Message should be out from the dugout. The twelfth man should go out and talk to Summit Mathur. Then don't go for the shots. It's now or never. You've got five overs left. And if he shifts the gears from here, if he gets 30 to 40 quick runs for his team, his job is done. Three on the way, Rupashir, Dusra offers Matra Satran. And one wicket on Kenam. Here, we have to go back to our own. Sumit Mathur has made 18 in front of the game. Sajad Ganai has made 8 in front of the game. 6 in the game, 2 in the game. Here, we are talking about the commentary box. That there is a big luxury for Sumit Mathur to reach the commentary box. You have to talk about some better in the game. But the game is back and back. Ishtiak Rasool has failed the game. And one run is still in the game. 4-5-4-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-
another pitch the way they used it and i don't think pitch is behaving uneven today it's not behaving like that it's a good ball is coming good on the bat the turn we used to see in the last match it's coming good today but still they're not able to play look at that one it's a good delivery and there is nothing wrong with the ball there is nothing wrong with the things there but the way they are batting they are showing no intentions the way they are batting they are showing no intentions to get the ball and play the big hits they are happy in dealing with singles dots and doubles look at this one dot one and dot four balls and two singles only and not they not tried not even a once to go for the big shot and this will hurt imperos i might be wrong but they might be clinking that last match and this time pull a pull hard over mid wicket and gets it all the way for the maximum this is what happens when you play with an intention and hang it up for imperos bhaiya stock tha ye sumit mathur ke balle se aur chair jit ke ye dekhiye khoobsurat stock tha और लाजवाब दूरी भी इसमें ऊंचाई जरूर थी लेकिन दूरी भी मिली वहां छ मिले सात में एम्प्रोस को सो पूरे होते हुए सोल्ड में ओवर में एक सौ दो चार विकेट के नुकसान पर रॉयल गुडविल क्रिकेट क्लब के विरुद्ध सुमित माथुर तीस बाईस गेंद से और यहां से अब अंतिम चार ओवर में कुछ और ज्यादा बेहतर करना होगा कुछ बेहतरीन विस्फोट आक्रमक शैली से बल्लेबाजी करनी होगी और एक बड़े लक्ष्य तक यानी कि एक सौ जो हम लगातार बातचीत कर रहे हैं वहां तक पहुंचना होगा और फिर गुडविल के सामने एक डेवता रखना होगा गेंदबाजी की अगर हम बात करें तो अच्छी खासी गेंदबाजी आपके पास है लेकिन यहाँ बल्लेबाजी में जब विकल्प आपके पास है तो उनका बेहतर तरीके से इस्तेमाल कीजिए और उनका बेहतर तरीके से इस्तेमाल यहाँ पे करना होगा सुमित माथुर और सजाद गणेश जो इस समय नाबाद बल्लेबाज है उमर लेफ्टी इस ओवर की अगली गेंदे करके इस बार फिर अच्छी गेंद थी ऑन साइड में खेला वहा हल्का सा फंबल हुआ नतीजा रन पूरा कर लिया और दर्शकों का शोर भी यहाँ गूंजता हुआ इस मैदान पे डीपीएस का मैदान जहां से लाइव प्रसाद अब तक पहुंच रहा है ओवर समाप्त हुआ सोलह पूरे एक सौ तीन चार विकेट के नुकसान पे अंतिम चार ओवर का खेल उमर लेफ्टी के पहले ओवर से नौ रन आए We'll make it 143, 11 and over 147, and two L and over. It's going to be 151. Oh, they're gonna get there. I think uh, they will be eyeing two L and over in remaining four overs. But who knows? Let's wait and watch. It's Robichir back into the attack. Two was one for eight. Look at his figures. Phenomenal. Look at the crowd! They're backing, whistling at the moment, and putting their hands together for both the teams at the moment. Uh, the expectations are very high on Sumit Mathur and Sajad Ganai. This pair, and look at the number of balls the two lads use it. Thirteen used by Sajad for his hard part nine, and Sumit used it twenty-three for thirty-one. Rope to ball, wraps him on the pad. Short for LBW and turned down by umpire. And it goes down to where the third man, leg by signaled, and that's four. Lucky boundary coming here. They're gonna take that. It hardly matters. Whatever comes bowling sideway, they need runs. Take a look again. What happened there? Oh, it it bounced. There was enough bounce. It was clearly going over the stumps and gone fine down to the third man. Blessing in disguise. He's gonna take that. Hundred and seven on the board. This is gonna hurt bowler. Oh, now there is due. Look at, look at Rubishir. He is rubbing it again as the trouser there. He is trying to dry it, and uh, he is losing grip over the ball. It's one of seven for four. We are in over number seventeen. Oh, good looking ball this one. Again, there is a shot for LBW, and turned down by umpire again. One hundred and eight for four. One away to four wickets down, and I think there are six wickets in hand. After this, just three overs remaining. They should go for the shots now. Get ten, twelve runs per over. It's going to help your cause. Runo ki avashakta bhi hai aur us rangati ko banana bhi hai. Scoreboard ko gati shilta dini bhi hai. Lekin abhi tak us prakar se sapalta mili nahi hai balle bazo ko. Sajad no pe aur unke saath sumit mathur batti. Six over pe char, sohna dashamlo do over ki gati bazi hai. Is baar bola. Ye kamal ka hai. Ye connection sahi hai. और मैदान से बाहर जाकर के गेंद गिरी है सजाद के बल्ले से निकलने वाला ये जस्ट बोखर चार रन मिले यहां चौका मिला और इस चौके के साथ रन संख्या एक सौ बारह तक पहुंच चुके हैं 
और ये देखिए खूबसूरत कनेक्शन लेकिन काफी ऊपर हवा में उछली गेंद जरूर थी और उसके बाद सीमा रेखा से अंदर एक कदम अथवा बाहर जाके रही हालांकि वहां अंपायर का निर्णय चार रनों का आया और इस चौके के साथ 112 सौ बारह चार विकेट के नुकसान पर रो बशीर ने दो दशमलव तीन में तेरह खर्च एक सफलता उन्हें मिली है अगली गेंद और इस बार फिर बाहर एक किनारा और गेंद सीमा रेखा से बाहर निकल गई चार रनों के लिए एक और खूबसूरत है शौक चार रन नार एक सौ सोलह चार विकेट के नुकसान पर The over they were eyeing for is coming their way. Impros on the charge now. Third boundary of the over. Sajad so runs will come when you will show the intention. It will they will come. They were defending and why will the boundary? Now they are showing some intention. Even edges are going for a boundary. And this was this is what we were talking about. Go for the big hits. Show some intention. Runs will come. It if it connects, it's all the way. If not, then no worries. And again, up in the air, Sajkaya. Field underneath, field underneath, and take on a drop. Nasir Ganai dropped it early, and they're coming back for the third one. And crowd on their feet, pressure of the crowd that make him drop the catch. Sajad Ganai has a lifeline. Listen to the noise. They're up on their feet, fingers under the tongue, whistles all over the ground, and one more put down. Was it Nasir Ganai or was it Mujib Alak? I think it's Nasir Ganai who dropped the catch there. Easy chance, easy chance. Yes, it's Nasir Ganai. He dropped it early. Should have been taken. Should have been taken. And one nineteen on the board now with four wickets down. Not projecting score is showing something. It's one forty one. And here goes Rupesh to Sumit. And Sumit plays it away. Finds the boundary. No doubt, and there is a field. Mujib Alak is there. He did well to stop the ball and save three runs for his team. Single time from the last over, but expensive over this. Expensive a lot. F three boundaries came from the over, and it's one twenty for four out of seventeen. One twenty on the board for the loss of four wickets after seventeen overs. Eighteen balls are going to come. Three overs remaining, and ten and over will make it one fifty, and uh, nine and over will make it uh, one forty seven around that. And uh, let us see where they're going to finish it off at the end of the day. Short pause in the game, but crowd is really behind Emperos at the moment, and they got their dugout pumped up, backing every shot. And uh, that drop catch from Nasir Bali, Nasir Ganai dropped a dolly. Should have been taken, but I think he lost the side because of the uh, because of the floodlights. And it's 120 for four. This is Cabaret Premier League, season one, match number seven underway. Sajad Sultan, Sajad Ganai, 20 of 16, and Sumit Mathur, 33 of 26 balls. And projected score is showing 141. Are they going to finish there? Current rate is 7.06 and over. 18 balls, all important three overs. They have enough bowlers left to bowl tonight. They have Nasir Ganai who's yet to bowl. They got Umar left. He's got almost three overs left in the kitty. Akimi didn't bowl tonight. He's got all the four overs remaining. And Umar left. He's uh, called again to bowl. He's brought back into the attack. First ever gone for nine, and captain is still showing belief in this boy. He believes in his ability. He believes that he is an able character with the ball. He can reduce the batters to singles. He can put breaks on. And let us see: Are we going to see some kind of breaks on the batters? Are they going to restrict to them, or will batters be able to break free? There is uh, everything is possible at the moment. Because it's a do or die now. You need in excess of 140. You need around 150 on the board to make it one good and evenly poised encounter between two teams. And at least 30 needed in remaining three overs. Need to go 10 and over to take it to 150. Around that will make it a good contest, I believe. But you never know what cricket has in store. First ball, bang it in short. Looks to pull. Goes one hand. One-handed shot and a little blind to be precise, because uh, he saw the ball banged in shot, and first he lost to the sight of the ball, and you can see that hat is going somewhere else, bat is going else, a one-handed 
He lost the grip over the blade. Went with the one hand. Just a single. Now that brings Sajad Sultan on strike. And is he going to throw his kitchen sink at everything? This servant, he need to do that. They still have six batters in Kitty. And look at that one again. A banger in short delivery. Goes for the pull. There is a man at Skelag. Rubashi does mop up. Only a single accrued. It was a backward obscure of the deep Skelag area. 122 for 4 in over number 80. एक सौ बाईस चार विकेट के रोकसान पे अठारह ओवर और एक सौ पचास निश्चित तौर पर लक्ष्य अरे क्या उस लक्ष्य तक पहुंच पाएंगे क्या एक सौ पचास का लक्ष्य रहेगा यहाँ एक सौ पचास के आसपास लक्ष्य रहेगा गुडविल के लिए ये देखना होगा सुमित चौतीस पे उम्र की ये गेंद और इस बार ऑन साइड में खेला जरूर वहां पीछे खिलाड़ी है जरूर उन्होंने गेम को फील्ड तो कर लिया थ्रो जरूर किया लेकिन उससे पर वो कुछ रन जरूर बैठो रहे अरे रन के साथ ही सुमित माथुर और उनके साथ सजाद का नहीं एक रन तो जरूर एक सौ तेईस चार विकेट के नुकसान पर दिलचस्प आंकड़ा एक दो तीन चार सत्तर दशमलव तीन के बाद बीस ओवर के पारे अठारवा ओवर तीन गेंद शेष इस ओवर के उसके बाद दो ओवर यानी कि कुल मिलाकर अभी भी पंद्रह गेंदों का आना बाकी दस रन अगर आप यहां से प्रतिवर के हिसाब से बनाए तो एक के आसपास वो लक्ष्य हो सकता है और उस तक पहुंचने का प्रयास जरूर करना चाहेंगे उमर लेफ्टी की ये गेंद हालांकि वहां पर हल्का सा प्रश्न पर से पूछा तोड़ करके रन तो पूरा कर लिया एक सौ चौबीस चार विकेट के नुकसान पर दो गेंदों का ना भागे और लगातार चार गेंदे आ चुके हैं और इस ओवर में चार रन आ चुके हैं और दो गेंदों का आना बाकी और यहां से दो बड़े स्ट्रोक की आवश्यकता और क्या वो दो बड़े स्ट्रोक यहां देखने को मिलेंगे क्या एक छक्का एक चौका देखने को मिलेगा सुमित माथुर के बल्ले से पैंतीस पे नाबाद है अट्ठाईस से और यहां अब विकेट का महत्व नहीं है यह रन गति को बढ़ाने का प्रयास करना होगा सुमित माथुर और सजाद गनाई की इस जोड़ी को एक पे चार ओवर लेफ्ट एक दशमलव में बारह रन उन्हें सफलता मिली नहीं अरे अगले गेंद माथुर के लिए माथुर ने उड़ाया हवा में है गेंद और नो मैंस लैंड में हालांकि रन तो पूरा कर रहे हैं अरे मुझे भाकर की गेंद को फील्ड कर लिए एक रन जरूर और एक रन के साथ संतुष्ट 125 पे चार सत्रह दशमलव पांच के बाद लास्ट बॉल ऑफ एवर नंबर 18 इट्स 125 फॉर फोर एंड इट्स सुधु मुसेवाला गोइंग ऑन इन द बैक to keep going on the wickets Sajad Ganai can be the man he's on 21 from 18 Sumit Mathur is on 36 from 29 Emperor Sarvan 25 for 4 and here goes Umar one more time again banged in shot pacey one and over comes 10 and good over this from Umar lefty just 4 runs or 5 I think 4 and we got man in colors Mr. Halal colored here it's 125 for 4 after 18. 2 hours to go, 12 balls to go, and 125 on the board. Can they get close to 150? We'll need 25 more runs. Need 12.50 uh, and over to force it and make it 150. Need to break free, need to break something, then to make something. It's to make and break to get there around 150. Smile is exchanged between Vijan Panchal and Sumit Mathur there. Sumit 36 of 29 balls. Well, uh, Sajad Sultan on to 21 of 19 and Roof call it again to finish his code. I had 3 overs, 1 for 21. And the third over that was expensive of the lot. He is called again to bowl. The penultimate of inning number 1 here. It's match number 7 being played between Royal Goodwill and M. Empiros force but today we saw good effort from the bowling unit talking of Royal Goodwill the bowlers are up to the mark yeah of course it is 125 for 4 Jiggy Sports time is a household channel in Valley it's a household name across the valley and now people are capturing moments on Jiggy Sports time from Gulab to even from Western countries it's 125 for 4 here is the next one. Oh, look at that one. Guided. He spawns it to point area. On the bounce. No run. It's a dot ball. It's a precious dot. Look at that one. He was trying to improvise. But the ball. Look at the cleverness of bowler. Cleverly done. He followed him. Bowled it wide off the off. He decided to spoon it away. But uh, just shot a man there. And it's 125 for four. Here is the next one. 11 balls remaining. And look at that one. Fuller one. Nearly oxim there. 
and he is unable to offer a shot there he was caught in two minds and feeling little uneasy there another dot here two dots on the trot good over this from roof thus far it's over number four of his quota 125 for four here is roof again third ball of the over and fumble on the field by nog well just a single there it's one two six for four half a stage in over number 19. <laughs> उन्नीस सौ ओवर तीन के दुकान बाकी रॉयल गुडविल अब धीरे धीरे से अंतिम ओवर में रन गति पर थोड़ा सा अंकुश लगाने में सफलता प्राप्त कर चुके हैं और सफलता पूर्वक इस पारे को समाप्त करना चाह रहे हैं 140 130 के आसपास इन बिटवीन 130 140 के आसपास समाप्त करने का प्रयास होगा लेकिन दूसरी ओर से जादूर सुमित माथुर एक तक अवश्य पहुंचने का प्रयास करेगी अगले गेंद और इस बार खेला हवा में है स्टॉक और एक बार फिर एक दो कदम आगे नासिर कुमार की गेंदगिरी जरूर फील्ड कर लिया और रन तो पूरा कर लिया यहाँ एक सौ सत्ताईस चार विकेट के नुकसान पे अठारह दशमलव चार ओवर की गेंदबाजी और दो गेंदे अभी भी शेष इस ओवर की उन्नीसवा ओवर सुमित सैंतीस बत्तीस गेंदों से सजाद नौ सौ की चोट पे बाईस पे बड़ा बेहतरीन मुकाबला ये सातवां मुकाबला इस प्रतियोगिता का खैबर प्रीमियर लीग दो हजार चौबीस का ये कुल मिलाकर सातवां मौका अपना पहली बारी एक सौ सत्ताईस चार विकेट के नुकसान पर अठारह दशमलव चार दो गेंदे इस ओवर के और ऐसे में देखना होगा इन परिस्थितियों में क्या लक्ष्य रहेगा यहाँ गुडविल के सामने ये गेंद और इस बार अच्छी गेंद थी आवश्यकता के गलियारे में ऐसे तैसे करके उसको खेला जरूर एक रन तो केवल मिलेगा और एक रन के साथ रन संख्या में इजाफा होता हुआ एक सौ अट्ठाईस चार विकेट के नुकसान पर अठारह दशमलव पांच के बाद One twenty-eight for four. Last ball of the penalty meter. Robushi to go. The last ball of his spell. Twenty-four runs and a wicket in his three point five fours. Sajad will be on strike and crowd. Crowd is asking for a six. So they need a six here. They need a six to destroy the figures of Robushi. Sajad. Sajad on strike. Will Sajad find a fans here? No, he won't. It's a dot ball. As Rubishir holds his nose, over comes Tana, 19th one down. It's 128, and four wickets down. We have lost six balls coming your way. 128 on the board. Royal Goodwill will look to stop to limit the score down to 140 or down to 135. And on the other side, Empros will go for the shots. But I think this partnership has not worked for Empros. They have still six wickets in hand. But look at the runs. One has played 33 balls. It means almost six overs. And another one has played 21 balls. It means four overs. It means 10 overs these two have played. And look at the scores they have got. They have got 60 out of 60. It means they are playing with a strike rate of one. Definitely nine overs and they have got 60 runs. It means that this partnership of no use. They have still six wickets in hand. And what they are going to do now for the six wickets? Nothing. It was better if they would have got cameos, little cameos, helped their team to reach to 160-170. Agree with your statement. It was to fire in between. Try at least. Give it everything. And they use it 54 ballers for 60 runs. And throws his bat at it. But finds Rithik in place. He's a nice athlete. He's a wonderful customer on the field. Quickly onto the ball. And releases it, sends it in, releases it in time and keeps it down to one. Good field there, one, two, nine for four. Prior to this, Abu Bashir were having a word with uh, Umar Lefty how to bowl under lights and under certain circumstances. I think he given him a pep talk, telling him what to do. Here, he's back into the attack. It's over number 25 balls remaining. First ball single. Sajad 22 of 21. Just around a around ball. Look at that one. It's gone beneath the bat. And they pinch a boy or not. No, no. It's a dot ball. It's a precious dot. One to nine for four. We are in over number 20. Pressure is on bearing side. They need some runs here. They need some hits at least to push it to around 140.
देखिए गुडविल ने कहीं ना कहीं अंतिम ओवर्स में अच्छी खासी रन गति पे अंकुश लगाया है क्योंकि एक सौ उन्तीस साझेदारी बहुत बढ़िया लेकिन उस साझेदारी का उतना ज्यादा लाभ मिला नहीं क्योंकि जब आप छह विकेट सुरक्षित रखते हुए इस प्रकार की बल्लेबाजी करते तो मैं समझता हूँ कोई लाभ यहाँ लिया नहीं बल्लेबाजों ने क्योंकि एक पे चार तीन गेंदे मात्र बचे हैं आखिरी ओवर के और अगर इस साझेदारी में कुछ इन बिटवीन कुछ बेहतर विस्फोट किया होता शायद तीस चालीस रन तेजी के साथ बढ़ा लिए होते तो शायद परिणाम कुछ और होता एक सौ लक्ष्य आपके सामने जरूर रहता है फिलहाल क्रिकेट में फैक्ट This was not the pitch like they batted. They batted mediocre tonight, as they were dealing in singles. Crowd was cheering, but that doesn't mean you don't read the pitch. As a batter, you need to read and understand the circumstances. It was behaving nice, and now he goes for a big hit. It connects and deposits. This is what the intentions can do. Had he tried it before 15, after 15 hours, situations and the scorecard might have been different. But just one ball to go now. And he is showing his intentions. It was better had he gone out on 25, 30. But great cameo would have been better for Ambrose. But look at now. It's still 136 on the board. Last ball up over number 20. Last ball of inning number one coming your way. On strike is Sumit Mathur. He's five runs away from his half century. Can he get? And look at Sajad Ganai. 24 balls. And 22 runs. It will be a single. Call is for two. They are going for the second one. Chance of a run out. And over lefty fumbled. And two runs. So 138 the finish on. And 139 will be the target for Royal Goodwill. Akimir and his company to chase this one down. Emperor's finish on 138. We shall be back for the chase shortly. Join us then. Till that, take care. Thank you.